video, we will be creating a kunai. So a kunai looks like this. So the first step is to add a wedge. So this thing over here, this blue. Now we turn it a bit over and we change this to 90 degrees. Now we make this 50 by 50 millimeters. And the height will just lower it down to uh, lower it down to like 15. Then the next step is to add another wedge and make it a hole. Now we take this and put it in the middle, like we just need to put it inside the object so we want to make this into the middle so we change the snap grid to 0 0.1 and we try to move it inside so once you think it's in the middle so maybe this you pull it aside and just to double check nope it's not in the middle so we continue putting it in that looks like the middle and then we take this out so that we copy and paste command C command V and then we place it next to the other hole and then so then we just turn it on 90 degrees degrees and then we do the same thing we put this in the middle so first let's just place it here we zoom in turn it out then we just find the middle so I would recommend that you like look over here and so this one you can see that it's far away it's more higher so then we just take this and go a bit inside yeah so there we have the first part next we select these by just dragging the mouse and then we duplicate so this button or control D or command D so you press that and then you can press mirror so M so if you press M you can get this and you can press this button which makes it the other way like opposite of like make it upwards so then you press this while it's both selected we pull it in until we see it's in the middle so if we pull this in you see that um, this gray line is going in so once we have this all together we change to the other side and then we continue from here it's in the middle yeah so from there we've got this complicated part so then this is the fun part it's where you group it so before that you if you need to you can just check it out how it's gonna imagine how it's gonna look see if there are any spaces in the corners so you can see that there so if you try to group this that's gonna be there so you don't want this little thing here so if you command Z or control Z or take it back you can use this pull it more inwards this even as well pull it inwards even these two inwards and inwards so now this should work put it in and group
Once you did that, you got this sword looking type of shape. So then, now we can lower it and we can change the um, the measurements. But first, before that, a really important step is to change this to 45 degrees. Once we get that, we get this small shape. So now, we can extend, change everything. So then, what you want to do is change this into 20 eight um 28 of millimeters then you can extend it by 55 the next step is really simple all you need to do is get this command c command v there and then then you can use this, change it to 180, so it goes all the way around, and we can lower it to 25 millimeters. Then you can attach this here, so go on the top and just check if it is touching. So now it is, so if you see it's not aligned right now, so you can just do this and press align so which is also L so if you see that you can put press this button to make it in the middle of this area if you press that it's now in the middle so if you see this now it looks like a top of the kunai now we group it and now comes the easy part okay so basically you need to just pull this aside for now and we just put it on the top and we add a cylinder okay so now first of all we always need to make the sides 64 now let's make this into 5 by five. Okay, so we've got this cylinder. So if we can't. We will turn this to ninety degrees. And if you can see, it's uh, round. So then we can just lower it using this cone. Make this into zero. And we attach it here. So if you see, there are these out these curves over here. So we don't want that. So then we add a whole square. So if we place it around here, we can just really simple, just group it. Yeah, and there you have a little edge. So then you can place this. You can pull it a bit. You, this is a bit too thick so you can just pull it down until the right height yeah and there you have the first part then you can pull this down here I don't change that just the middle part here and we add a torus so this blue thing so we add this, it's kind of like a, a tube, but then this is curved. So you want to make the sides as highest as possible, and you place it on here. So you might be thinking, oh, this, this is too small for home. So then you can just make the radius, I mean the tube, like one. Oh, bit. that's a bit too small so maybe just two yeah so then you can just change the um, measurements so you want it to be the same so 25, 25 so there you can just attach it you don't need to make a hole because then it doesn't really matter here so as you can see this is a bit 
shorter than the cylinder so you can just make it higher just a bit over there and then yeah so then normal kunais are usually black so then we can just move this and we can make it black so there you have it there is a nice kunai